Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Afterlife. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. matches. Interesting. Is that normal or...? Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be? Angel or Sky? Rather go with Sky. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Go eat a dick, Johnny. You won't find any use for weapons inside. We hope you enjoy your stay. Hi, I'm Sky. And you must be Valerie. Well, looks like this will be interesting. So, V, you're dying. How'd you know I'm dying? Deep inside, you fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. I asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. Think you know me well. Okay. Tell me what I'm so afraid of. It's something you don't talk about. Everybody's entitled to secrets. Got my own with good reason, too. Say it. Say it out loud. Not for me, but for yourself. I snuffed it once and I'm gonna do it all over again. Got no idea how to stop it. There. Happy. You're scared. Because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased. As if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? The people I've lost live on in my thoughts. And that's what I'll be. A memory. Or just an annoying little voice in someone else's head. You don't see death as destruction. 
the end. But as a change, that thought alone could save your life. I think I might just be afraid. So I imagine these things to distract myself from the thought of the void, because that's about what greeted me before. Fear is your most effective weapon in the fight against death. So what now? Now, you find out what it is you need to do. Which is? You gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should've. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going where you needed to go. And it won't stop you now. But how do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you never look back. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it burn. Thanks, uh, for all this. Jeez, don't even feel like getting up. You do, but everything has its end. Afterlife. <laughs>